everyone, so this is going to be a video on my summer skincare routine and just to clarify, I am wearing a strapless dress. I'm not naked as much as I'd like to be right now, but no, um, I am wearing clothes. So this video is just going to be me talking, showing you guys my um, go-to summer skincare routine and uh, kind of walk you through some stuff I like to use. First things first, this is me with like zero zero makeup on. You can see um, my skin's not perfect. It's good skin, it's healthy skin, and I take care of it, but it's not perfect. So yeah, like I have some discoloration. Um, I get really red through my cheeks, so yeah. Anyway, so I wanna talk to you about the products I use um, specifically in the summer to cover my skin. Um, first things first, I always cleanse my skin in the morning. I've used the Spectral Cleanser. I have a review a couple videos back on that one. Um, so that is what I like to use. So in the morning, when I do my summer skin, that's what I'm gonna label this as, hand sanitizer, of course, unless you just wash your hand. So the two main products I like to use together is I like to use the Spectro um, Daily Moisturizer for dry skin, and I like to use the Neutrogena face sunscreen. This is SPF 45. This, however, doesn't have any SPF in it, which is why I like to switch it up with this. So what I like to do is I just put about half a pump of this stuff on and about an equal amount of sunscreen on the back of my hand. I know this may seem like a lot, but I take it right down my neck as well. So, And then I just mix it up on my hand and do the very simple mum thing that every mum, I think, in the last 50 years has done. <laughs> Comment down below if your mum did this, because my mum definitely did this. And then I just rub it in. I take it right over my lips as well, just to make sure that all of that is covered. Now, one thing I will say is that this moisturizer is great, great, great for dry skin. I have dry skin all year round. In the summer, I get a little bit more oily in my nose, but I still hydrate it as if it was dry skin. And then with the sunscreen, I happen to really, really love this. This is a great sunscreen. It doesn't break me out. It has um, all of the stuff that you need, broad spectrum, UVA, UVB. Um, I put a ton of sunscreen on in the summer. I tend to slack off a little bit in the winter, just because it's not super sunny here where I am in the winter. If it's sunny for you all year round, then you might wanna do this all year round. Um, but definitely this. Now, on the days that I know that I'm gonna be outside for a really, really long time, I will wear just sunscreen on my face. I find it gives me enough moisture to get me throughout the day. But after I have applied it, what I like to do is go eat lunch or go eat breakfast if I'm at home. Um, basically, with all sunscreen, you want to let it sit on for about 30 minutes to absorb fully into the skin so that it has the effect that you want when you go outside, which is basically protecting you from the sun, right? So that's what I like to do. I like to mix these and then I like to go sit and eat my food and all of that stuff. But for the sake of this video, I'm going to let this just hang out. Now, it already is not tacky in the time that I've talked to you. So then what I like to do is go into a full full high covered summer makeup. So what I like to do is I like to use the OCC um, skin tint. I love this stuff, tinted moisturizer. And then I just shake it up. It has a little bit of ball, a little bit of a ball in the bottom. So you gotta kinda, kinda shake it up. Okay, so then once I got that on my hand, then what I like to do is just take a stippling brush like this, kinda dot it. And I like to focus this stuff on my cheeks more than anything because that is where I get really, really red. And this provides just a light amount of coverage and it keeps the skin nice and dewy. So then after that, you can see that my skin is a little less red than it would be because it covers up pretty good. And for a tinted moisturizer, it covers up pretty good. So then what I like to do is I like to take the OCC Skin Conceal on a like pointy concealer brush like this one. And that is just gonna go anywhere that I think I need even a little bit more um, coverage. Uh, normally, like I said, it would be my cheeks or any spot that I'm breaking out. 
So then once the concealer is applied, that would be kind of my finished face. Now I normally would just wear this. I like the kind of dewy, shiny look in the summer. If I was going out though and wanted even more coverage, and this is normally what I'll do for a night out because I find if I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna get really, really sweaty, this is not enough to kind of last me throughout the night and it doesn't really set. Um, so what I like to do is I like to take Studio Fix powder and again, this powder is going to put on almost another layer of sun protection, so your face shouldn't burn at all with this stuff on. And that is the finished face. So yeah, that is pretty much everything I do for a summer skin. And I showed you kind of the before and after um, for going out. I would wear obviously a lot less powder if I was just kind of doing, like, going about my daily day. Um, but I put on a lot more powder for when I go out. So that is obviously my finished face and then I would go and do my eyebrows and blah 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 and all of that other stuff. So yeah, hopefully you guys kind of get a tip about my little summer skincare routine. Um, it's not anything super revolutionary, I must say. It's just kind of, I like to mix these two products work like really, really well um, together and then I love tinted moisturizer for the summer. So. Yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this, and until my next video, I'll talk to all you soon. Bye.